Hey everyone, it's Bo with English Realty Group at Keller Williams Gulf Coast. Um, about a storm out here on the beach, but I just wanted to show you some quick uh, construction that's going on. Alright, so the place we're in now, we're up on the third floor. Uh, it's on El Areola Drive, five bedrooms, five bathrooms. Still being built, almost done, uh, 2,644 square feet. Remember, we're running the uh, the giveaway week contest, so if you uh, share, like, and comment on here, I'll uh, enter you into a $50 gift card to a place of uh, your choice. I'm going to have a couple options, uh, coffee shops, restaurants. So um, the reason I started inside here is because it is so windy right now. Uh, they're actually vacating Fort Pickens. That's how bad it is. I haven't checked to see if it's a tropical storm or if it's just a cold front moving in. But uh, some of the power is not going to even be hooked up yet. By the way, uh, this is the very first Dr. Horton official beach house I've ever been in. It kind of blew my mind when I saw uh, they were building one out here. I know they have a development going in um, in Perdido Key. And they've got a pretty high-end development over on 30A in the Santa Rosa Beach area. But this one is up on pilings. It's right on the beach in Pensacola Beach. Well, it's right on the beach. Um, it's not waterfront. You've just uh, got a little walkway to the water. I'll show you the best I can without uh, lighting. But Let's go down to maybe some of the better lit rooms. This is, of course, the first two rooms are going to be bedrooms. And here's the master, this is going to be the master bedroom. Awesome view right out to the beach. Look at those waves. I just want to show you how windy it is. It's ridiculous. Let's take a look at what's going to be the uh, master bedroom. I'm sorry, master bathroom. We have a tiled in walk in shower. This is going to be glass right here. There's a view to the neighbor's house. Bathroom has some pretty good, nice uh, beach views. This is going to be uh, your bathroom, toilet area, and then your walk-in closet. Let's head down to the second floor. Uh, this isn't a bedroom, just an office. There could be a nursery, it has its own balcony. Try to get out of here before the storm hits. Here's what's going to be your kitchen. With a huge island, granite countertops. This is your formal living area. Check out this back uh, deck here. You may not be able to hear me out here. Jesus. There 
hire somebody to go uh, kite surfing today or kite boarding. Here's another bedroom with an ensuite bathroom. Tiled in shower. Okay, we're gonna head down to the bottom story here. <laughs> this goes downstairs, right? Uh, Locked out. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Hardware locked on it. Hmm. Can I credit card on yeah. it? <laughs> I got you. Yeah, okay. I got one. But I don't know if this is the right way. <laughs> awesome, thank you, man. Yes, Okay, down to the bottom. Okay, so washer, dryer goes down here. Um, sink, stuff like that. So th this, hey Ashley, this is a DR Horton too, by the way on the beach. Fun fact. So this bottom floors are made to be um, washed out and flooded. These are all telephone poles that the house is up on. And just to kind of give you an idea of how far you have to walk to go to the beach, let's take a walk to the beach. Really not supposed to walk through these sand dunes. Go up to where they start. All right, well I'm gonna get out of here before the uh, storm hits. Uh, thanks for checking out my live stream. Appreciate it if you shared it, liked it, and commented. I'll enter you into the drawing at the end of the week. Um, there is one more foreclosure on the beach that just popped up on the market that I'm going to try to take a look at. So if you stick around for a few minutes, I'll uh, try to get into that property as well. Thanks for hanging out, guys.